Hey hotties, welcome back to the channel, it's your girl. So today's video, I'm gonna be talking about how to get motivated and stay motivated. Because personally, I'm going through that right now, especially you guys know about the house fire that I just been through. It's just so hard to sometimes get motivated and stay there and stay motivated. Like, sometimes I just be needing to push, girl. Sometimes I just, you know, be needing a fire under thy ass, okay? So, I just wanted to share some tips that I've done that I'm going through right now, you know what I'm saying? Just in case somebody's going through the same thing, don't know what to turn to, I got you, hottie, I got you. But, um, yeah, girl, so if you're new to this channel, my name is Ebony. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and turn on your post notifications so you know when you're gonna upload another video, okay? Y'all, y'all like this hair? I do not want to do a part today. Like, uh, all I do is middle parts. And I just did not. Uh, y'all know I got to lean up because I, I can't see. You know, I'm blind. If you're new here, girl, I'm blind. Okay? Sorry. But, y'all, I just um didn't want to do a part. Girl, this is a synthetic wig. <laughs> well, I, and I got this from the beauty supply store. But I know some websites that sell it or whatever. Um, So... I will link it down below if y'all are interested. But yes, girl, I'm like, I don't know. Let's do a little flip over method thing. I don't know. How do it go? Do it go like that? I don't know, but. Girl. I don't know, girl. Oh, hell no. Oh, I done fucked it up. What I did. Oh, girl, I didn't mess this thing on here up. What I done did? What y'all had me doing? I should never told y'all and touched it. Bitch, I don't know, but um, let me stop fucking with it because I'm fucking it up. Anyways. So I did write down some things. They are in no particular order. So, yeah. And y'all, like, it's still hard for me because of the fire. It's just so, it's just been so freaking hard. Like, uh, I wish y'all could just be here to see what I'm going through and also like I've been lacking a lot of motivation just because not only the fire situation but just my family situation everything is just so messed up like you know like I just go through little spurts of depression if you will like I don't know if I want to use a strong word like depression but I sometimes really feel like that y'all like it's just so sad it's just so sad let's get started so one of the things that has helped me actually is listening to positive podcasts um and listening to positive affirmations i'm just going to put those two in the same category just because you know they go together so you can listen to positive podcasts and positive affirmations you can search some on um youtube and everything like that people who are just talking really really positive um saying positive affirmations you can make up your own affirmations that you want to repeat and recite daily you know like it's certain things that um people that I follow on YouTube. I don't want to tell you guys exactly who I follow, but you know, cause I want y'all to find your own person. Cause you might not like the person that I listen to. And I just want you to find your own person and vibe with your own person. However, when you do find that good person, like I'm telling you, they're going to like open your eyes to so many different things that you just didn't think of. Like, um, yeah, it's just, like for instance, what the one of the people that I um, listen to, she said things like, you know, let me see if I can find it. Let me see, girl. Hold on. Pause. Um. Okay, so let me show you guys. Let me tell you guys. Okay, so let me tell y'all a sample of some positive affirmations that you can repeat to yourself every day, okay? So you can say, I am thankful for another day. I am blessed with the love of people who choose to be around me. I am happy about who I am and how far I've come. I have everything I need to create happiness within. I will give something back to this beautiful world by radiating a vibe full of love. Like you say those things every day that can just, that just push you in a really good mood 
puts you in a nice mindset that will boost your motivation. You get what I'm saying? Like, like I said, it, it'd be the simplest things that just put you in a good mood. So I do suggest you guys start reading, um, start getting, you know, your daily affirmations on, honey. Okay, because it's gonna put you in a really, really good mood, okay? Okay, so the next one is, <laughs> I would have never did this, okay? I feel like I'm, not, I'm like, I don't know. Anyways, some of my eye y'all stuff. I'm looking goddamn caca. This is crazy. So the next thing I got is do one thing that scares you or gets you out of your comfort zone. Do something that scares you. Do something that gets you out of your comfort zone because once you do something, for instance, I would never go out to eat by myself or go get a drink by myself. You know what I mean? Like, personally, me, I used to just be like, I'm not about to be out there looking like a little lonely soul. Like, <laughs> y'all, like, it's crazy. But I used to be childish, you know? I'm I'm growing up. I'm getting older. I'm maturing, okay? So, yeah, but um, I used to would never be out by myself going to get a little something to eat or a little drink because I used to be like, like I said, I ain't about to be out here looking like a little lonely soul. Like, you know, but that was childish at me, okay? This is grown at me. This is on her shit at me, okay? <laughs> so, yeah, that used to, so I start doing that. And when I tell y'all, at first, my anxiety, I don't know why, but my anxiety was just like through the fucking roof. Yeah, but I got over that fear. I was there to get out of my comfort zone. I was doing something that kind of made me uncomfortable. And once I got over that, like y'all, when I tell you it just made me feel so good, like a breath of fresh air. Like, girl, when I left and I got in the car one day, I was just like, damn girl, you growing up. Like that made me feel so good, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, do something that gets you out of your comfort zone, that scares you a little bit, okay? Because you're gonna come to see, it's gonna make you feel real good, you know, so. And that motivates you to be able to do something else. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's do it, girl. You can do it. You can do it, Brucey. <laughs> so the next thing is the um, workout. Workout and get a healthy diet. I am doing that now for the fucking 15,000th time, okay? I've always been trying to, you know, get on my healthy shit. And I'm, for the most part, healthy, but see me, I snack a lot. I'm a chip queen, bitch. You put some chips around me, they won't last to the, they, like, what? They won't make it to the next day because they won't be gone because I like chips. I don't like cookies, cakes, none of that. I like chips and sour chew candy. You know, anyway, but if you pick up a good workout and a healthy diet and you get on a regimen with that, like I was before the fire happened, the fire just knocked me all the way on my ass. Oh my God. I was working out every day doing HIIT workouts, okay? HIIT workouts. I was burning like 400, 500 calories every day. And then the fire happened and I picked up smoking habits. I picked up crazy eating habits and I'm trying to motivate myself and keep myself motivated as we speak to get back on my regimen you know what i mean it's hard but i can do it and so could you so like i said get you a good nice diet going on i'm not saying be uh vegan i'm not saying go crazy because there's levels to that shit so i'm saying do something that works for you um and try not to eat i mean if you gotta eat lettuce eat lettuce but try to do spinach because lettuce i don't even think is doing nothing for you okay honestly it's so pale it's not even green try to get spinach because lettuce is full of water <laughs> just pick up a nice workout and a nice diet and um yeah and just get on a nice regimen and i'm telling you guys like that workout, working out just makes you feel good anyway. When you're done with your workout, you just, your lungs feel more clear, you know, you just can breathe in deeper. You, it just makes you all overall just feel so much better, so good, and it motivates you. And then it makes you wanna be productive that whole day. Yeah, that really has been helping me. So, and I know it can help you, girl, okay? I hope I don't look crazy. So, um, yeah, next, 
Okay, y'all. So the last thing that I want to share with y'all is, I'm sure a lot of you guys already know this and already does it. But does this do this? Pray. You can never go wrong with prayer. You can never go wrong with praying your heart out. Praying to, I don't want to disrespect, but praying to whoever you believe in, whoever is your higher power. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, like I said, between the fire, between the family situation that I'm going through, and, you know, I have dad issues and, you know, just a lot of stuff that I think about and go and go through and stuff like that. You can never go wrong with praying. I pray, I cried, and you just pray until you can't pray no more. You pray until you feel better. You pray until you cry it out. You pray until you feel better, like I said. And it's like hitting a reset button. And after you hit that reset button, I'm telling you, you're going to feel motivated. You're going to feel brand new. You're going to shake it off. Um, yeah, girl, or boy, you can never go wrong with praying. You better pray, baby, because that's going to give you that push, that fire under thy ass that you're going to need, okay? So, yeah, y'all. So, I know this video was kind of short, kind of, you know, whatever, but, you know, I'm getting back to this, you know, YouTube thing because, you know, I've been going for like two months. <laughs> so yeah i got more videos coming i got a random vlog coming um just some stuff that i had saved on my camera so i'm just gonna put all that stuff together and post it soon just to kind of get it out the way so you know if you did like this video if it helped you with anything one thing something then give it a big thumbs up make sure you share rate comment like subscribe all that turn your post notifications again like i said so you can know when i upload another video and yeah follow me on all my social medias they will be linked down below and that's the end of this video girl so i will see you guys later